What's up, everybody? Um, had a surprise happen today. Got a package in that I've been waiting for for a while. Um, it's a seatbelt for the Mazda 3 that we purchased not too long ago. Actually, it was, man, it was probably five, six months ago um, at this point. But when we had purchased the car, the girl who sold it to us, she had replaced the seatbelts, the front seatbelts of the vehicle, and didn't check them uh, when we went to go test drive it. And so... They, when I went to go use the seatbelt, it didn't work. And I, I talked to her about it, and she said that she would um, she would make sure that she got it fixed. Well, right after um, we got the car, she said that she would order the seatbelts and then let us know. And then she didn't and became MIA, uh, is what's normal in today's society, I guess. Um, so she stopped communicating completely. We got got another contact information and she talked to us for a little bit and then wouldn't return phone calls or text messages um, to replace the seat belts so we we decided that we were just going to do it ourselves um, it's only a couple hundred bucks so not that that huge of a deal but um, we had purchased one set and they got here and the company that sent it to us they sent us the wrong ones ones that didn't fit my car specifically so we returned that then we got then I'm thinking that it might be the buckles that are the issue because the the seat belts the the metal insert doesn't uh, just wouldn't fit into the buckles that we had. So I bought new buckles and that wasn't the issue is the actual seat belt. So then I um, that whole process took a couple of months to get it just shipping with the companies that we've been working with have, has taken forever. So then we uh, we purchase another uh, a, a seat belt for the the driver's side uh, front seat and the company that we purchased the seat belt from they set it up as through eBay we're waiting for for it to, to be delivered the day that it was supposed to be delivered comes up and there's no package so I contact them and they tell me that they had an accident in their system that they didn't have the seat belts and that um, that they canceled the order so that took a month, that whole process. Um, and so stuck without a seatbelt still. So I finally went to a, another another place and got them to order the seatbelt. It came in today and pretty excited. Um, so we got the box. I'll show it to you. Here's this. It's taped up really nicely. Um, they did a, a good job with that. So I open it up and they have another box in here. And so, wasn't thinking much of that. Then I open it up again. And as you can see, they have another box. So I was pretty stoked. One package, three boxes. You know, that doesn't happen very often. Then I open up that box. And there's another box. <laughs> uh, while being wrapped in plastic twice. So there's there's our part that we were the seatbelt that we're looking for. I gotta go test this and actually see if it'll fit on my Mazda 3. It's a 2011 Mazda 3, so I'm hoping it does. If it doesn't, what the heck? Um, this was certified that I put in my VIN number, so it was certified that it would fit. Um, and we still have the buckles that we purchased as well that were certified for my car. So. Here's to fingers crossed.